Hey brainstormers, welcome to Chess Minds. Here we are back with an exciting video of just 8 moves. But before beginning the game, if you are new on the channel, do subscribe the channel, like the video and share it with your friends so that they can also learn the best moves to win the game in 8 moves. So, let's start the video with e4. c6, e4, e5. And yeah, this is a Karukan defense variation, which later turns out to be Mrs. Attack with Bishop d3. This is a very good position for Bishop, which later sets his career. After Bishop d3, we get nf6, and after this move here, Black has to face every other move forcing. We get e5, forcing the knight retreat. We get nf d7. Again, we have e6, which leaves you two choices to move the knight again to b6 or accept the pawn here on e6. But yeah, if you try to be greedy by accepting the pawn, this would be your biggest nightmare, and which obviously black does. f takes e6, then we have queen h5 check and after this again all the moves are forcing leading to checkmate for black g6 queen takes g6 check of queen sacrifice we have h takes g6 a forced move and bishop takes g6 checkmate but yeah white could have made his game oh sorry black could have made his game bit better by not accepting the pawn here he could have gone for something like nf6. Then we can get e takes f7 check. King takes f7. nf3. c3. c6. e g8. This leads to the blocking of the rook and the bishop here. Then we get castle from white. nc6. qe2. c takes c takes and b4 attacking the bishop which is really powerful here he is controlling a great board area so you black wants to take this bishop with the exchange of knight h3 knight takes h3 queen takes h3 bishop d7 bishop f4 and after this the game continues and for black this is a really weak diagonal the knight can't move because he's protecting the pawn which is attacked by the queen and can be later supported by the knight to g5 the knight can in time come to c3 attack the pawn threatening the knight to move from this position and leaving the pawn without support the rooks can get to e1 he gets a semi-open file Rook a c1 is also possible, giving a fully open file, and everything leads for a very bad position for black. His rook here is trapped, bishop is trapped, his pawns are passive. So, here, this would be better than just a move in eight, eight moves, I guess. So, this is our checkmate, a forced checkmate for black. So hey guys, this is for this video. If you want similar exciting videos, go on subscribing the channel. Meet you with the next exciting video. Bye bye till then.